Brother, you have fallen to some Valandian recruits. Even these guys are already retreating. Okay, there's some weird lag spikes. I'm gonna have to alter this all as well, am I? No, not really. We did kill a decent amount of them. I'll just hold resolve the rest of this. Since they are going to be just retreating, and I do have a ton of tactic skill. Look at that. Only four losses. Tear was captured. How dare they? Ah, the party capacity was so much higher just because I did have, uh, or I did have, I was over capacity on troops. That makes sense. Not because of the perk. Now let's give it to the troops. I don't want to be carrying around armor and shit. Oh, come on now, don't flee. Attack. I can see what happens. Now I can't really tell if it's a if we're attacking the siege. Oh no! Probably not. Oh no! There's a fucking rock in the way. Never mind, you could. That's fucking annoying. That's a big fuck off line of fucking harshers. I think the blizzard is on their side. No, 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 no. Don't you dare. Start running away already. Headshot, bitch. Who needs tactics? We can slap them with a the big dick line, indeed. I mean, most battles can be just solved with uh, F1, F3, right? Just charging. There's not much you can do. Uh, unless you're fighting, like... I guess... God damn it. I can't tell where I am. Unless you're fighting like against the really shitty odds, then you may need to cheese the game. Or not cheese the game, but sh maybe use some tactics like not charging in immediately. But after a little, a little while, after you use up all your uh, archers or something like that. Like in the horse lords, pray too. 
We have spearmen, yet we cannot kill horses. Makes sense. I'm, I'm still waiting for the uh, Eagle Rising when they add the Greeks and the Spartans and the Macedonian Macedonians and Athenians or their versions of them. I am gonna implement uh, use the Spear Rework mod. So maybe with the Spear Rework mod, maybe Spearmen are worthwhile having. Pro I mean, I don't have my hopes up, but maybe they are. Or I mean, if we're gonna be using the Greeks, we only have a we're only gonna have hoplites and phalanxes. So uh, yeah, we'll see how it works. They're fleeing again, the little bitches. Flee for for the mountains. Yeah, it does. It, it really is like when you get through, with, if you play with fill stacks, when you get rid of their first army, uh, the rest is more or less just shit. Looks like we did drag them out on the field. Damn it. Why do they keep. What? There's a lot of these guys who are just... Why does he fucking look wounded? There's only 12. Uh, there's a bunch of these guys with no armor on the field. That's a good... Well, a great sign for us. A shitty sign for them, I guess. Let's take all this. So, never mind. We're we don't have the capacity. I guess that's the biggest problem. If you do uh, go infantry only, increase charge damage by zero point fifteen. Ooh, that I think that's better than one we had so far. I think we had one at most. Right. Uh, maybe I need to talk to the other guy, give him some uh, stuff. Noki the Brave. Peace. The party lead Peace to me, yes. Uh, commanders in your party. Uh, apparently we can't do that yet. Or we can't do that at all. Like, yeah, uh, I forgot to give him a banner. Probably giving the, him the banner that does, like, uh, you deal more damage would be would have been a good idea. Or at least a movement one. Okay, so far... Okay, now I have everything I would want to have. Maybe... I, I want to piece out the Valandians, then maybe take out Sionon. Flint Log Castle. And Epicreta. I think we're going to end the playthrough there. We established ourselves good enough. I'd say. Oh, we're going to get money from them. Sure. We dealt for them. Now I uh, kind of wish my guys didn't go for uh, Azurai. Because, you know, they're a bit far away. Hmm. Would be cool if we can, like, uh, let's actually do this. Let's send them a message. Maybe there's diplomatic options now. Wait a minute. He 
Is it? I mean, maybe the game is just bugged like that. Maybe not. Okay, that's nice. He's still at war with me, apparently. <laughs> that's good. That's good. Let's see, do we, do we have any diplomatic options here? No, apparently not. Oh, that's unfortunate. It would be cool if we could, like, uh, you know, ask so we can, like, join the war with the Batanians, but, like, we get uh, some money in exchange or something. You know, well, like, I guess that gets into total war territory or, say, the king's territory. Maybe too advanced for this game. We are going to play Banner King, so maybe Banner King uh, does actually implement some systems like that. I didn't play it for that long. Possibly does. Okay that. okay, that actually increased our speed. Maybe could they actually go for more uh, horses? think we wanna okay I think this guy this this guy is gonna lead that army into its death probably maybe not well, let's let's not mess with it too much let's not be too controlling I guess <laughs> but I have a sneaking suspicion they're gonna go up there and be taken out by the Ezra If I don't keep him on my on me, loads of money. Can we declare war on Batanians still? Five percent chance. So probably yes. In a, in a little while, but I could go and see if we can uh, find some uh, horsemen, some uh, desert people to kill. I didn't do that yet. Something was besieged. Okay, I might, I might need to stay here and um, see, maybe save them from getting destroyed. I won't join the siege, though. I don't want to suffer the um, stupidity of the AI by not being able to get up on the walls. What's up? Oh shit. Well, f shit. Do that. Do that a bit. Do it a bit faster. Come on. Okay. Yeah, I might need to suffer the stupidity of the air a little bit. They should be getting to the walls. They don't have any. Mongrels, catapults. I think we do need three infantry lines for this, though. Gonna spread them apart. Which 
archer line archer line there there we go hopefully this is gonna make them you know actually use all the siege equipment and have a party left for the ladders like the first line is on the ladders like they should be thank god now hopefully they don't get like stuck on the ladders okay actually can't see the ladders from the gr grass This might be a time for the sword. Close quarters and all that. I don't need an axe to break the shields, man. Anymore? Come on. Don't just stand there, fucking move. Yeah, look. I think it's like this since the full release. Okay, they're fine. Like what, they're waiting for these, like, like a certain amount of them to get up the ladders so they actually move and do shit. What's up, Ahsoka? How dare you close the gate? Come on, boys. I'm actually curious what's up with the... Okay. Ah, all, all the troops that were supposed to be on the siege tower just... Uh, fucked off and did something else, I guess. Ah, I see what the problem is. They all switched to the ladders, apparently. I probably should have chopped down the gate. It would be much faster. I deal a lot more damage. Easy peasy. No, oh, that was fucking amazing if that actually hit. Nine right, kills, not enough. Hmm. 
I can almost give that guy, but... Which settlements? Which settlement would I give him? Uh, not like it matters at this point, this is the last stream for this play too. Ah, sure, let's upgrade all these. I'm gonna place them in the garrison anyway, where they might as well be the best they can be. Garrison. And after this, we need to quickly run the fuck away. Or. I oh, know they just did. Okay. okay. They decided to besiege a city instead. And what I could do... Hmm. No, they don't have enough garrison. I was thinking maybe when they do start the bes you know, siege, get the actual, the, the actual fight, maybe we could actually jump in, just pull out the gas and kill them. But our uh, former enemies... Okay, I, I, I ain't catching those, that's for sure. <gasps> How dare they? No! He had zero troops. Now we just need to catch this guy too. Well, there goes one party, of course. Um, these guys lost a lot of shit. Let's give them something. Okay, noise. Now let's see how many prison zero really. That's a surprise. Right, we can pick up more mules, I think. Let's see. Yeah, I don't think we don't think we're gonna have a herd bonus in a while. A herd debuff in a while. Any beer? No. Come on. What kind of Northman doesn't have beer in a city? They probably drank it all. They had beer. You bought it, did I? I just click, I don't even look at things anymore. But they, they didn't have a lot, did they? Ooh, who's besieging this? I oh, god damn it you They had like that? Eh. Well this puts a kink into my plans. I guess there's not much we can do about it though. Let's see. Maybe get a piece with them. Break lines. Right, for... Why doesn't he want an alliance, though? Like, you, we still have 98 relations with him, but I guess the other clan members... Well, it's not like they had any say in it, did they? They don't have enough influence. No, 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 I know, I know, no, no. When, but when I did, it, it says that they don't want uh, alliance. Even though they actually proposed an alliance to me. 
at first. Okay, we still do have Sinopa. And they took this from us. Let's see how how much garrison they have in there. God fucking damn it. Yeah, there's no point in having parties unless you have the... Even with that, with that mod that... Uh, that you use to... Yeah, they're asking for an aggression bank, see? Uh, what was it? The party AI overhaul, I think, something like that. Even if you have that, they still... Uh... Oh, look, it, we can form an alliance. Oh. I guess the question now is going to be what happens... Uh, like, what happens when one of them declare war on someone? I guess, let's see if that pulls us into, an, into a war or something. That's just a band of 60 looters. What the, I'm, I'm, we've seen bands of like 100 looters by now, probably at some point somewhere. But though both of those parties got destroyed, which is nice. Regrouping, regrouping. There is a mod that apparently makes them create the party again. And the amount of high, uh, fucking bandits here is pissing me off, to say the least. Let's get rid of them real quick. Ultimate speed. I'm actually surprised he took that many hits. Granted, we did hit him with a shaft. You hit his shaft? Maybe. I'm not delicious, don't quote me. <laughs> That's what she said. I hit them with the shaft, man. Where the hell are... Okay, they're coming in, but slowly. I may be too fast. I'm too fast and furious. Well, granted, they did try and uh, actually hit them with their range weapons, so maybe that's what slowed them down a little bit. Six mountain bandits. Yeah, we actually lost a guy to them. Maybe I should make the guard parties bigger so they can more easily take these guys out. I think now they're like 50 men or something like that. They are there. Will they form another 
I don't think they will. They will they? Yeah, I don't think they will. Take care of the party. Take care of the party. Actually, now let's see what our party capacity is gonna be if we place him as the party. Yeah, I thought he's bigger. Yeah, but they still want a decent mountain garrison, and they do take out troops out of the garrison. Okay, he did increase our party capacity a wee bit. I'm just gonna keep him in the party because, like, what's the point? Of making. Additional parties when they're just gonna get destroyed. You might as well just wait up and save their renown to make the uh, clan, give them land, make them a clan, then making them parties. At least then they're gonna make their own shit or change. Let me see this as well. Okay, which ones did we make? Room Fjord. I think that's one. They have three members. Good Freed. Ironside. Okay, they have four members. I think all of them are. Well, I don't think she's the leader. But these guys certainly are. And if it, uh, he lost his shit. These guys, oh, these are mercenaries, right? That, yeah, we stole, like, doesn't tell me anywhere how much are we paying for them. Which is a bit annoying. 46 looters. What get, just get the fuck off. Oh, they're just gonna surrender. Works for me. Uh, I guess we could declare war on. I still think we want to declare war on the Batanians. If you can, I'm gonna stream this for about an hour and a half. They will have their own budget. Yeah, but uh, I'm not seeing here how much are we paying for them. Ah, payment to missionaries. Now it appears 50. Well, that's fucking pretty cheap. Might as well see if we can grab more mercenaries, actually. Just send all of them a messenger, because we do kind of need more troops. It does look like most of them are already in a faction, so we'll see, I guess. And some of them didn't want to join us. Let's see. Let's send them all a messenger and see what happens. Oh, he's already with us. That's me, actually. As many as we can get, that's gonna help. We don't really have a lot of parties on our side. We only managed to nab one... Um, one clan from Sergia that has a decent amount of troops. I don't think these... I think those guys didn't want to join us or something like that. Remit. Help them. These are with us already. Wolf skins. I don't like any. Maybe it would be a good idea to maybe not kill the mercenaries and let them go so you can maybe get them at some point for yourself. Maybe. Just maybe. That would have been a good idea. <laughs> because like this, they all hate you. Maybe wish heroes could form a mercenary band like what one of your companions. That could be cool. Since in Crusader Kings you can make mer yeah, you can make mercenary bands. 
That would be cool. Like, yeah, and you get influence from them. Not money, but influence. That would be pretty cool. Uh, service missionaries. Okay, these will. I'm a mercenary. I look like shit. I have a Sturgeon high level troop and uh, I think that's cataract. They don't want to serve us. He's, I think he may not be on the field. Oh, these fucks. Oh, fuck. Uh, maybe I should pay attention to what they're saying. No, this is... Ah, oh, they're in a faction already, that's probably why. Dragomir. He's uh, with the Volandians. It's been a while. Yeah, Companion or Wanderer. I think Banner Kings actually implement something like that. So when I do start streaming that, which I'm not sure if I may, like, I want to wait for because the 1.0 patch did that a ton of stuff and didn't fix a lot of crashes. I kind of want to wait for that to come out fully. And uh, Arch Heavy Group, I know, I know. Uh, I kind of want to wait for the mo uh, for the game version to update to that one. And I think the Banner Kings mod already has a working uh, version for that, for the beta. So I might wait around for that, play Hades, maybe some Total War in the meantime. Nights of Wonder, such things, we'll see. Elder Kings, that's the uh, Crusader Kings Elder Scrolls mod, right? I'm not good at Crusader Kings, by the way. I'm not as good as Dread at Paradox game. I'm trash at them, in fact. That's why I like the Knights of Honor more. There's a second one out. The second version of a mod. What? For CK3? Ah. So the, the other one was for CK2, I assume. Anybody else? Anybody else? Yeah, I think that's all of them. Let's see how many mercenaries we do have. Three mercenaries. It'd be decent to see how many troops they fucking have. That would be actually pretty nice. If you have even a Passing interest in Elder Scrolls, it will be worth. Well, I like the Elder Scrolls games. I'm not that into. I'm not that much into the lore. If you get. Like, I like Fallout, but like, knowing all the lore and whatnot, that I'm not that interesting, uh, interested in it. I'm more into Warhammer, of course. Warhammer 40k and uh, Warhammer My Fantasy. More into that. Like, even Star Wars, I don't know much about Star Wars or uh, Star Trek for that matter. I'm a Warhammer fanboy, basically. No, I don't even... Elder Kings is more you making your own story. Oh, I might check it out. Do, do you need any DLC for that? Because I don't really have any DLC for Crusader Kings 2 or Crusader Kings 3, for that matter. I 
That may be an issue if you do need DLC. Doesn't require the DLCs. Okay, good. But how can I make my own story if I cannot make my own character? Because that's the DLC. One palmation was added to my inventory. We have bred a horse. Oh, we have some trash to sell. At least you talk. I know. I think. Uh, I think character creation in both games is a uh, DLC. But I guess I could buy that or just get the paradox. Um, uh, the, the, the DLC thing you can buy and subscription thing, whatever the fuck it's called. It's a free DLC this time. Okay, okay, I'll check it out. I did get uh, Crusader Kings 3 on a uh, Humble Bundle. Humble, I think it's Humble Choice. It was on Humble Choice. We're allied to them, but we're paying them as well. <laughs> uh, lovely. We can declare war on the battalions. I wish, uh, I kind of wish someone initiated that. Since, uh, how much do we need? 150, right? I think someone ended the mercenary contract with us. 150, yeah. Yeah, they did. We need a free DLC. Was in the game as it launched with it. Uh, have you ever heard of day one DLC? <laughs> day zero. Zero hour DLC. That's kind of a hot thing right now. I'd have to install the game and check. I'm really not sure. Yeah, I just need like a couple days to get the enough get enough influence. Something rebelled. Oh. Well don't mind if I do. Wait. That's gonna eat all my influence, is it? It is, fuck it. Let's do it anyway. But it has its own expansion for L Kings. I'll, I'll look at I'll look into it. I do I do kind of want to do a playthrough of all the well, uh, Oblivion, Skyrim, definitely. Fallout, maybe not three because Fallout three just keeps crashing all the fucking time. It's fucking annoying to say the least. But Royal Course, yeah, I know about that one. Fallout New Vegas, definitely. Maybe Fallout 4? Maybe at this time I could actually finish the games. Because I never actually finished games. No, I one of them. And Morrowind... Morrowind may require too much reading for what I would like for now. This one takes place in the second era, which is the only game to take place in that one. That one is the Elder Scrolls Online. Uh, yeah, I, I remember. I remember we us talking about that. So that's pre-Oblivion, right? Yes. Who needs influence anyway? Pre every other game, so pre Morrowind as well. Get help for once. They already want to parlay. 
Imagine someone making the like uh, Pirates of the Caribbean mod for this. It's uh, parlay. <laughs> Being an actual like feature, full on feature, that would be fucking fun. I'm not sure if we're gonna Kuzites. Wait a minute. I declare war on them. Ah, wait. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like, since we are allied, let me just check this, uh, factions, no, not that, looks like, since we are allied, looks like we did get forced into a war with the Kuzites, let's see, uh, declares war on the Western Empire, summer 17, Yeah, yeah, if you are allied, it does seem like you're forced into a war when your ally gets declared war alone. Well, that's actually pretty good. Since we are allied with Sergians and the Western Empire, both of them border the Zites, even though the Sergians are not at war with them. As the fourth era began at the end of the story of the stuff, this game has two start dates and basically all the other games take that place. And the other ones that take place in the beginning of the third era during the times of the time split. What? I may need to watch some uh, Elder Scrolls lore videos, apparently. Okay, we are gonna attack this so you just don't take it like, you know, dishonorably. Basically, the second game in Elder Scrolls has four time, four way time splits. Nah, okay. Calling me surpri surprised. Call me fucking surprised indeed. Basically, the second game in the school has, yeah, basically with Morwen being where they are, made one again. Jesus fucking Christ. Diffusing ass shit. At least I know, um, I know what to do in Skyrim. Join the Imperium. And I know what to do in Fallout New Vegas. Join the C C Kaiser's region, legion. Simple enough, right? And I would want to do that just because uh, nobody joins the C Caesar's Legion anyway. There's probably a lack of playthroughs with that anywhere. There isn't really. But is, is there or is there not? You need to build twist for you. I mean, it basically does give you a, a reason to replay uh, Fallout a bunch of times just because there are so many options. Every faction run, yeah, but like in the recently, I'd say. Because whoever I watch, everybody hates the Legion. They despise him with a passion. Recently there has been a few. Really in challenge runs. Uh, well, I'm not doing challenge runs. That's for sure. I will, I will be playing those games with like the unofficial mod patches and all that. So I may not get the full like OG experience. But the bug fixes are too good to pass up. Flee towards the temple. 
or the keep. Character challenge runs. I would have to be really good at the game. Like, I'm not that into any game to do challenge runs. That's for sure. Wait, I can, like, what? Okay, I guess we're pillaging, pillaging it. Who tries to complete the game? Say, as say Hank Hill or Dale Gribble? To be honest, they are not that challenging. Well, they're probably challenging to someone who doesn't really know how the game... Well, not how the game works, but like, doesn't know all the mechanics, I should say. Do Boom Hoovered in either Fallout 4 with the NCR right on the or in New Vegas? Boom ho, ho what Boom Hoovered? What? What? King, oh, it's been a while since I, like I watched King of Hill back in the day a little bit. I would need to rewatch it now. You know, watching it as eight years old, you, you know, or something like that. And well, I probably didn't understand half the shit. Not that like I watched a lot of it either. Blonde haired guy. Look, it's been it's been 15 years since I last saw King of the Hill, probably, and if not even more. <laughs> no, I don't remember anyone. I remember Bobby, the kid, right? Who else is there? What's his dad's name? I have no fucking clue. Who's gonna be able to keep a hold of it? Let's give it to this guy. Like the knees, and you remember the name, yeah. But I, I didn't really watch all of it or any of it for that long. Like, I only watched a couple of episodes that showed up on TV here, which is not a lot. I think the show was cancelled, even or not, not cancelled, but not shown here at all. For the most part, there's only a couple of episodes, if I recall, maybe like five or six in total that I caught. We do have a decent amount of uh, reinforcements we can pick up. Where do you live? Bosnia, ex Yugoslavia, the Balkans. So, yeah, shows here. Like, even South Park was barely a thing. Most people. Like, people started watching the shows you watch when we got, like, Maybe high speed internet. Maybe some even just started watching shows when they got Netflix. You know, such things. I think South Park was the only show that you could watch here that aired. We did have Cartoon Network and Super RTL. You know, with Hills on YouTube. Yeah, I know. But like. You know, the, the older guy, older people didn't, who had computers and internet access wouldn't watch that shit. And we, the young ones, didn't have internet access. And most of us didn't know English that well at that point, you know. Takes a while. Let's see. Right, minus 40. I can't really... Can't really uh, declare war on the Batanians now at this point, right? If you could have pulled pulled the surgeons into a war, that would have been awesome. 
Okay, so since we know what's gonna happen if I go over there, we're gonna get the clear war on battalions or some shit like that. So let's go down there. See what happens. Yeah, the culture here is a lot different. That's what Americans don't really get. Like, the shit you watch, the shit that's popular in your culture, it's... Nobody fucking knows about it. Like, if you did a poll on in the ex-Yugoslavia or in, the, in Europe, I'd bet you, like, maybe, like, 5% of the people know about the King of the Hill. Of all ages. I, I don't really want to take anything down here, yeah, that's for sure. Let's, uh, what was besieged? You see if you're gonna uh, kick some, uh, Horse Lord ass. Well, that fucking rebelled quick. The culture is a lot different in Europe, and it's a lot different. Uh, the, the problem is with Europe, there's a. Uh, to country, to ca from country to country, the culture is a lot different. And then, you know, the Balkans, everybody thinks the fucking, we're like the Middle East, Americans especially, think we're like the Middle East or some shit like that. Or no, we're not exactly first world, but we're not exactly third world either. We're somewhere in between. Ah, there we go. Well, hello there. Let's see how well we do against horsemen. See how much Well like he do he definitely doesn't have the uh skills I would want him to have for this since I didn't choose him. Let me control the army. Now this is more like it. Across the whole army, like back in Total War days where you stretch out the phalanx across the whole fucking Well, I didn't want to really spawn all the way over here, but sure. They're gonna have a shitload of fucking skirmishers, though. Well, I mean, it's only an army of 300 or something. Uh... I think literally South Park is the only sh Western show that was aired here. But, you know, besides Tom and Jerry in the Cartoon Network cartoons. Disney cartoons and all that. They're all the retreating, apparently. God damn, what's happening over there? I want to see, I want to see, I want to see. Ah, they're getting slaughtered in the woods. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna fist them. Okay, one loss. Uh, who the fuck are you? Why are you so fast? Uh, it's one of uh, one of the characters, companions. 